I wanted to say there are so many hitchhikers. We already had three couples on the road. Where are you going? Mountains. We already saw three couples. This is it like a, a game you're playing. We participate in an auto stop race. Good morning, afternoon, or evening. What is up? My name is Marta. Welcome to the vlog. Welcome to welcome to the live doc. Shit, I should not say that. Welcome to Volus Vibes. Welcome to our life. That's what I should say. As you can see, packing up because uh, well, Jason is not feeling that nice. <laughs> You're not feeling so well, are you? No. We're going back home. Do you feel a little bit better when we go back home? Yeah? <sighs> well, at least you're not crying. Because that was going on the entire morning. We're collecting stuff and we're making sure we're getting back to Volos. It was a nice visit, but with a sick child, it does not go that easy. Anyway, let's collect the stuff. It's not my proudest packing moment in all honesty. It fit a lot better last time. Well, last time we had better, more stuff with us, but now I just dumped it in there pretty much because we have to go. Durak is going to sit now on his own chair instead of last time just on the floor. And then we just need our child, my wife, and we can go to Volos. This is all a little bit like last moment. Seven o'clock, we're gonna have a visit in uh, Volos of the doctor. You know, it's our first child, you know, that's also the, the issue probably that we're completely like stressed out. We don't know what to do, but we we're also expecting him to be feel a little bit better today. And it uh, didn't improve actually. It, in all honesty, it, it worsened maybe a little bit. He doesn't have he doesn't have a temperature yet, a high temperature. Anyway, Durek, you're gonna stay here for a second. You're gonna wait for us to get back until we sit all in the car. Yeah, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. We take him everywhere. Unless you're staying at home with like grandpa, grandma, or Mariana, yeah? Yes. So long as grandpa is still in the back trying to collect some fruits and vegetables. Because they want to give us some fresh stuff, but uh Shota! Fevrume! Tivrikis! Madano! Celery. Celery. Now I'm going to go They're so nice. We got like fresh stuff again, everything as well. I don't know if I have my phone in the car though. Where did I leave my phone? Let's have a bite of Anana. <laughs> Found it. One o'clock. We have to make a quick stop because Jason has been sweating his ass off in the car, sadly enough. Look at his little red face. Yeah, did mama, mama throw a blanket over you because she thought it was nice for you? <laughs> well, it's actually 28 freaking degrees outside. Take off your clothes, babe. Get, get naked. Nobody cares. No, only you probably. I need to help you. And you. Mister, what a nice Alex Sierra you have here. What a nice... Why are you looking at? Waar kijk je naar? Mama? Mama met the camera? Oh! Yeah, he's not really that wet, by the way. 
I want to say there are so many hitchhikers. We already had three couples on the road. Ju one just after Veria, one before these Diodia here, and another couple here, but I don't know where they went right now. I wanted to ask them if I could help them in any way. I can't, I'm not gonna take any hitchhikers with my baby though. And we have a cat in the front, so it doesn't really fit also. But still, I was about to ask them, but I don't see them anymore. There was a girl standing right there, actually. She was like wearing hot pants with her red hair and everything. And there was a boy sitting right there, so... Maybe they got in somewhere when I, while I was actually here? Who knows? They were going to Athens, they said. But there was another one that was just standing next to the road with a sign that says help. With ya, but right in a turn. But it was a turn before Athens, by the way. Hey! Are we gonna sit in the car again? I will try to dress it, maybe. Are we gonna turn the AC on? I don't know. Uh, I have to say, by the way, this is one of the best stops always. We did a live stream here once. And I have to say it for a second, look at this. Olympus. It's an outer grill here. It's always super nice to be here. Especially when the sun and the weather is like this. We've got another 110 kilometers to go to Volos, so let's do it. Oh, actually, I see the boy, the hitchhike boy. Maybe we can ask if he needs anything. Where are you going? To Athens. To Athens. Because I wonder, was wondering, we already saw three couples. This is like a, a game you're playing to go as fast yeah, as possible. We participate in an autostop race from Poland to Greece and Enya. Ah, okay. Is yes. there a way that they can help you online? Uh, we only need transport to Athens. Too bad, because like we have the cat and the baby, so it yeah, doesn't I fit. See, I see. Okay, <laughs> Good luck. Thank you, you too. Bye. From Poland to Greece. Well, good luck. So it's a race. That's why we have so many hitchhikers. I thought it was like an entire Yes Theory like group. I don't know. Windows closed and driving. Stop talking because he's distracted. Sorry. Okay, he's distracted. We arrived and we survived. At least for Ilona it was survival on the back because she had to keep Jason all the time very nice and calm. But Ilona is a power girl, you won't believe it. Do, 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 do you know that you have a power mama? You have a very she's strong... Broken. Yeah, okay, yeah, she's broken, but still, you're, you keep going. Look at his face. Jason. Oh, so hot there. Durak, freedom. Come on, boy. You're back home. <sighs> Crying since four o'clock. It's almost six now. Mopping the floor so we don't have any dust now is because maybe because he's got like an inflammation in his neck or maybe it's dust or something around us. Keep the air a little bit humid. That's why I'm mopping the floor right now. We tried to do everything, right? Ilona has been a power girl on the back of the car with the crying and everything. And now again, he ate a little bit. He slept in her arms and he started crying. A little bit he ate. It's not good. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was the day before yesterday, for us now at least. Uh, you just saw a black screen and that's all. Because the doctor came over, we had one sleepless night, then a, a day that I said to myself, I'm gonna pay attention to this boy and to my family and uh, not grab the camera and everything. You guys have to wait because family goes first. <laughs> He's laughing. But meanwhile, we had two sleepless nights already, huh? And we have a little bit of a fever now. Yeah. And still you're smiling and drooling a lot. Yeah. How's Mama feeling? Mama's looking amazing, by the way. Yeah. 
How are you doing, boy? Huh? Did you sleep every two hours? Or every time for two hours, let's put it like that. So, uh, and what are we gonna do now? Go again to the doctor. Yes. Because at the last visit, he said, well, the moment that uh, he has a fever, just call me. Well, no, he did not reach like fever high. He just had a little higher temperature. 37 and a half, started 37 and a half. And then it, and then it went all the way to 38.1. And that's actually fever point. So uh, he opens at 1030 and uh, he let us come first. And Ilona tries to feed Jason now a little bit. Because he did not eat, well, he eats from mom, from the boob. But uh, that's all. That's all, yeah. He even sounds like an old guy now when he coughs. It's like, <coughs> and yesterday it was like very clearly normal coughing. Let's skip to uh, Kiriako. Kiriako is our doctor, by the way. infection and a little bit of a, a throat infection also I believe and that means that right now this boy needs to take it very easy for the next time coming seven to ten days he's going to have uh, uh, antibiotics sadly enough we're gonna use some something that he like has to breathe on because it will calm his throat because he's got too much slime in the back of the we did our best people to get him better but we're not we cannot skip antibiotics anymore we, we tried to skip antibiotics but it doesn't work like that so and we he has to get better so eh? because we want you to, be, to become big and healthy and strong anyway uh, I hope you still like this vlog if you uh, this live duck I hope you still like this live duck and uh, Thanks for watching. If you liked it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below because we love to read and we always reply. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you next one. Bye.